Let's start the video, guys. Sort of okay. Imagine playing the Ouija board when someone asks the dreaded question and this happens. Do you mean that's any harm? At first, we could eat. First, we could easily assume his friends were playing a prank on him. But when everyone lifts their hands off the planchette, things take a turn to the dark side. But were they really contacting an unholy presence? Or using magnets under the table? Heck, is the Ouija board even that scary? To make our own conclusions, first we need to go back to where it all started. Picture this. Late 1800s, the spiritualist movement is sweeping across America. Charles Kennard, founder of Kennard Novelty Company, sees an opportunity and seizes it. In 1901, Charles, along with Elijah Bond and his employee William Fould, both inventors, create the infamous Ouija board to suck on all that sweet paranormal trendy juice. The name Ouija, some believe it to be a blend of the French and German words for yes, which is in fact a common misconception. According to its creators, the board itself revealed the name in a session where Clarks asked a ghost to name it. He even went as far as claiming Ouija is the ancient Egyptian word for good luck. Spooky marketing strategy, right? Fold thought it was cringeworthy, so when he took over, he made sure to spread his version. A combination of the French word oi and a German ja, meaning yes. Despite its eerie reputation and greedy history, it's now a kids game owned by Hasbro. But not everyone's a fan. Religious groups criticize its use. And it's also a staple in horror stories, of course. Scientists, however, attribute the planchetta's movement to the idometer effect, a psychological phenomenon where a person makes motion unconsciously. So. With all this, what's your take? Is the Ouija board really a portal to the spirit world? Or did these guys just use some trickery and great acting skills to create a spooky video? Let us know your thoughts. Number 9. CCTV Ghost Sighting Street cameras Cannot believe this actually adds I hate when this actually happens, whenever I actually still be able to be able to make a scary reaction like this. Most people have no clue.
that in 2023, the best way to make money on Amazon is not with physical products. See, it just keeps messing up. Street cameras are meant to keep an eye on the living, right? But what happens when they begin to capture the dead instead? Take a look at this creepy video. What looks like a half-formed apparition can be seen emerging from behind the pole, like some kind of portal, before vanishing into thin air. Sure, the potato quality makes it way too easy for anyone to add some cheeky editing, but there's something particularly eerie about the nature of this footage. Doesn't it give you the willies? Could it be a real ghost sighting? Or perhaps just a lady walking and a CCTV camera glitch? Let us know what you think I about this one. Could even be like a Number eight. The bathroom ghost. TikToker Kelsa underscore Anne had been having this tingling sensation around her house. After some time, it escalated into seeing shadows move out of the corner of her eye, the water turning on, and drawers opening by themselves. But she wasn't able to catch it on camera. Well, that was until she captured this. Like following the traffic signs, following the road signs, even the stop signs, even the traffic lights. Mom! Yeah. Where is it? 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 Nothing is more terrifying than seeing your kids spooked by something you can't fight. But before we analyze this one deeper, let's take a look at when she started to capture this bizarre occurrence on camera. Okay, so I have been trying to catch this on video for at least two weeks now. Um, I have been seeing things move. Everybody thinks I'm nuts. I know what I saw. There's nobody here, my doggy. <laughs> okay. Come on, ghost, if there's a ghost in this house. God. Oh my God.
do. Okay. Oh.